Alright guys, it is an absolutely spectacularly gorgeous, and I mean over the top beautiful day here in paradise in the end times at Bugs in a Jar Farm. It is, I think it is Thursday, it's June 9th or 10th, so June 10th, it was one year ago today that I pulled up in Bugs in a Jar Farm and started this uh, vision here and uh, so the vision has taken a major literal step forward 20 steps forward as us white boys have been out playing like Inca Indians so it has never been a that easy to get up to the where someday I will build my uh, hopefully Someday a house will be built up here, but uh, we have been out digging through the old moonshine still and other places around the property. Getting the stairwell leading up to, uh, oh man, so maybe even Sandy can make it up now. Well, here we go. That is all there is to it. To get up to the... Or someday, there may actually be a tiny house. You know, that's where that uh, beautiful cherry tree fell, but it sure did open up the view of the pond. But now, pretty much anybody can walk up here. We still have a lot of work to do, but uh, the digging and the main stairs are in. Good Lord. <laughs> what a day. Someone who's had three hernias obviously lost my mind. Lost my mind. Man, it is a fine evening and we need to go search for libations and hopefully live music at the Brookton Market. Where it doesn't appear anybody is wearing masks anymore. Come see us at the Brookton Market. There you go. <laughs> a stairway to somewhere. Ah, look at all of this. Ah! Mm. Man, I'm whipped. I am whipped and it is time to go party. Now that the work is done. My friend Jack in the pulpit. He was here last year. Got a caterpillar on my Jack in the pulpit. And then he... Oh boy. Man, what a gorgeous day. And there's several more to follow here in paradise. Next project is turning that shed into a tiny house. Good Lord, so we uh, got the shed. We bought a door and some windows. But that will be next week. Good God Almighty. Work never ends. <laughs> 